Hi everybody. In the discussion in both of my online summer classes for teachers during the last week, there's been a lot of discussion on should we use announcements, how do we use announcements, and one of the things that I find useful is that in my classes I, I do use announcements and I put the three most recent announcements at the top of my class. And I find that really effective. It took me a while, I'll be honest with you, I didn't know until this summer semester that I could do that. So I thought you guys might like to know how to do that. In the settings, and this is pretty hidden, in the course details, if you go into more options, you can show the recent announcements on the course homepage. And you can also choose how many. Then you also have options to let students attach files to discussions, let students create discussion topics, let students edit or delete their own discussion posts, and let students organize their own groups. And you have other options. Oh, and here, this was one David was talking about. You can disable comments on announcements, and I do think that's a good idea because I never catch when students do that because they don't gain notification and I'm not looking at my announcements again. So I hope that this is useful information for anybody who's considering using announcements in their class.